welcome back students in the earlier video we had seen what is social justice and equality in this video we will see the efforts made in india to bring about social justice and equality we start with reservation of seats in educational institutions government services some seats are reserved for scheduled caste scheduled tribes and backward classes this is meant for those sections of society or for those people who have been deprived of opportunities for education and employment for a very long period of time prevention of atrocities act in spite of abolishing untouchability and the right to non discrimination under article 15 of the indian constitution the scheduled caste and scheduled tribes still were discriminated against therefore in 1989 this act was passed against crimes like murder arson rape etc it makes provisions for relief and compensation for victims of these atrocities it also makes provisions for establishing special authorities who would implement and monitor this act this act prevents any injustice against the people belonging to scheduled caste and scheduled tribe provisions for minorities who are minorities in any society a group of people of a particular religion language or race who are few in number are termed as a minority on your screens you will see pie chart which shows distribution of people according to their religion and their linguistic breakup The Constitution of India has made provisions to protect their right to equality, freedom, right against exploitation, and cultural and educational rights. The government has adopted several policies for minorities to provide them the opportunities for education and employment. Laws relating to women post independence many laws were passed and provisions made to empower women several policies have been adopted at national and international level to remove illiteracy among women the right to have an equal share in the property of the father and husband dowry prohibition act against sexual harassment domestic violence prohibition act are some of the important provisions which create a favorable environment for protection of freedom of women this act makes it possible for expanding the scope of indian democracy in the in the true sense the 73rd and 74th amendment reserved 33% of seats for women in local self government institutions This percentage has been raised to 50% in several states including Maharashtra. A national commission for women has been established to protect the rights of women. Now there are three branches of the government. Executive which implements laws, legislature which makes laws, and judiciary which gives justice. Judiciary is a system of courts that interprets and applies laws in the name of the state. It is a mechanism for resolution of disputes. It helps in removing injustice in a society and establishing a healthy society. 
While giving justice, the judiciary ensures that the fundamental provisions and objectives of the constitution are taken into consideration. The Basic Framework of the Constitution Indian Constitution as a Living Document Indian Constitution is a dynamic living document as it can be changed and adopted to suit the changing times. The judiciary has accepted the parliament can make changes in the constitution. To make changes in the constitution is a privilege that the parliament has. But at the same time, the judiciary keeps a check to ensure that the basic structure of constitution does not change. When we talk about basic structure, we are talking about things like Republican and Democratic form of government. We already know what is a dem democratic form of government. That is rule of majority, where people directly elect their representatives or they elect people who will form the government. Federal structure of the constitution. Federal structure means there is distribution of powers between different branches of the government and the center and the state. Students, do you remember what are the different branches that we did in the earlier slide? Different branches are executive, legislature and judiciary. Promotion of unity and integrity of the nation. Unity and integrity means the state of being whole and united. The next is sovereignty of the nation. It means that the nation is the supreme power and there is no outside power or nation which has any authority. Next is secularism and supremacy of the constitution. It is the principle of separation of the state from religious institution which means there is no religious bias or no single religion is given importance. Next we come to features of good governance. Accountable and responsible government which means a government which is answerable to the people, which is responsible to the people. Effective and efficient government. A government which is effective in its implementation of the different laws and policies which have been created for the development and progress of the people. Responsive government. A government which is responsive to what is happening around itself. Its policies and decisions reflect what is happening and what is currently going on. Transparency in working of the government. Just an all-inclusive development. The government ensures that all sections of the society are included in the development process. People's participation in the governing and decision-making process. People's opinion or public opinion are actively sought while creating any laws and any policies. Next, we come to significant judicial decisions. The courts have protected the rights of the citizens by giving judgments that support the fundamental rights of the citizens. The court has given judgments on rights of children, protection of human rights, protection of the honor and dignity of women, individual freedom and tribal empowerment. Now the government's acts and policies have not put an end to all the problems that the citizens face. Several new problems keep on emerging over time. However, what is important is that the people in India have developed a democratic mindset. 
students with this we finish explanation for this lesson thank you for listening goodbye and take care